Hi, this is Matt with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we'll be showing you how to repair your appliance. Remember, anytime you work on an appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. In this video, we're going to show you how to change out the GE dishwasher tub to cabinet trim. It's going to be a very easy repair and it's going to take a few minutes to show you how to do it. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can click on the link below or get it at AppliancePartsPros.com. When you open up the package, you're going to get the new tub to cabinet trim. The tub to cabinet trim is located on the right side of the tub and it takes up the gap in between the tub and the cabinets. The main reason you'll be changing it out is if it's lost or damaged. In order to change the part, we have to pull the dishwasher out a little bit. First thing we're going to do is open up the door and use the Phillips screwdriver to take out the screws that hold it to the countertop. Once you have the screws out, we're going to lift up on the door and carefully pull the dishwasher out a little bit. We're only going to pull it out far enough so you can see the tub trims. Now that we have the dishwasher pulled out, we have access to the tub to cabinet trims. There's three of them on the tub. They're all different, but they're changed out the same way. The trim is just pushed onto the tub, so all you have to do is pull it off all the way down. Once you have it free, you can pull it off the dishwasher. Here's the old tub to cabinet trim next to the new one. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can get it at AppliancePartsPros.com. To put the trim on, all you have to do is press it onto the tub frame right here. And when you get down to the bottom, you want to make sure it goes in between these two pieces. Don't try to wrap it around both. To put it on, you just want to line it up with the little cutout on the upper trim and push it on. And then just push it on all the way down. Once you have it installed, we can push the dishwasher back in. We're going to close the door and carefully push it back in. Once you have it in all the way, we're going to open up the door. So we're going to use the Phillips screwdriver to put the screws in. Once you have the screws in, we can close the dishwasher door, plug it back in, and take it for a spin. Thanks for joining us for another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. Check out our other repair videos on our site, Facebook, and YouTube.